welcome to the Toro Fangata. I can't do the voice, of course, but you're listening to another episode of the Into Final Space podcast, where we have a very special fan episode today. Over the past few weeks, Into Final Space has joined with Final Space Facts, an Instagram page bringing you really great information about the show to host a three-week-long art contest with a new topic each week. From there, we narrowed it down to three winners who we'll be talking to today. To keep it consistent for them, we've given them all the same questions, but with the winners all over the world, a group interview was unfortunately not possible. But let's meet our champions. All right, welcome to Into Final Space, and we're chatting via Skype from our studio in Atlanta. Uh, if you can go ahead and tell us uh, your name and a little bit about you. Wait, real name? or Whichever you want. Your your real name or your uh, your social media handles works fine. Uh, okay, I prefer an alias name. Uh prefer to me as cry and what else did you need to know just tell us a little bit about yourself okay uh i'm a working student and that's it <laughs> <laughs> but yeah that's it i can't i can't i don't really know what else to say yeah that's fine um all right so let's just let's get into a, a few questions um right. so just to start with uh why do you love final space um okay uh I just appreciate how good of the show is. I found out about the show in a cartoon site, not knowing what Final Space was. Uh, this was when Final Space was still ongoing. So I gave it a chance to watch, and next thing I knew, I, I was already on the second season. The animation was so smooth and flawless, which I think was one of the aspects that let me give the show a chance. What attracted me more was the storyline. I was just too invested. It's great. I'm <laughs> relieved that I didn't have any negative feedback towards the show when I first started watching it. I, absolu I absolutely loved it. I heard some people dislike Gary's character, and when I heard that, I was like, huh, what? What's there to hate <laughs> the Gary? He's a goofy, bold, and devoted guy. I can see why, though. But... I'm relieved that I didn't have a bad impression on Gary for the first time. I genuinely loved him when I first saw him. And yeah, that's it. <laughs> yeah, awesome. Yeah, Gary is, uh, he was, Owen's voice was kind of, you know, picked out a lot during that first season. Um, I can see why. A lot why, of fans. But, yeah. <laughs> um, I can see. <laughs> but yeah, um, so can you just tell us uh, a little bit about when you started doing art and what got you into, you know, drawing and working on different oh, types of oh projects. Dear. <laughs> oh, yeah, all right. Uh, this is going to sound a bit weird. Okay. <clears throat> I started doing art when Minecraft was a huge thing in YouTube back all right. in, yeah. <laughs> I believe, 2012 or somewhere around that era. There were these YouTubers that took the game as their content, and their content was just fun to watch, which I don't know why, but that inspired me to draw. It started off with a Minecraft style, style, but over the years, as I discover new things, I changed my style inspired by said new things. Final Space being the recent thing I found out and have a new style inspired by it. I guess I do art just to have fun out of it. I wouldn't consider it a skill of mine. I wouldn't say I'm good at it, but I love doing it. Yeah, that's it. <laughs> Yeah, well, you're definitely very good at it. Oh, thank um, you. Yeah, yeah, Minecraft, a uh, great, great reason to start. Throwing back a little <laughs> bit uh, and making its resurgence now. Um, but yeah, mm -hmm. um, so what? What for you is what's what's special about doing fan art for Final Space? That's you know different from some of the other styles that you've drawn in. Well, Final Space has been one of my recent inspirations. It motivated. It motivated me to draw, that's one. And Final Space is just a really incredible show. Making fan art inspired by it just proves of my appreciation towards the show. And showing it to the Final Space small community, it's just, uh, what's the word, welcoming. It's welcoming because I never really showed my art back then and never appreciated as it is. But now that I'm finally showing it, it's a good feeling that some people like it. Plus, the character designs in Final Space just looks really cool. Especially the mains like Gary, Quinn, and Avocado. They're just so fun to draw. Yeah, absolutely. Um, and of course, uh, coming off that, uh, who is your favorite character from Final Space? Ever since he said his first line, 
avocado is my favorite. <laughs> I think I think it's his voice that made me love him. <laughs> yeah. But, uh, as the episodes went by, it's his character and origin story that made me attracted to him more. He's such a great and well-written character. I was really upset when he first died. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah, other than that, it's a, it's the voice. It's the voice aspect that made him my favorite. Well done, Cody Galloway, for a wonderful delivery to his character. Absolutely. Yeah. And Cody is, he's always really fun to talk to. And got a chance really? to meet him this summer. You've talked to him once. Yeah, I, I met him this summer um, at the season two premiere party. Um, oh my God, that's great. Wow. We got to chat for a little bit. He's, he's just, he's always so nice. So often he's got that, that kind of gross warm voice um you know it's kind of just must have been, must have really been fun interesting. to listen to yes yes he's a very interesting guy um and yeah to, to just wrap up do you have uh anything that you want to plug real quick anything you want to promote uh your own art or uh, any uh, your not, media? nothing really no, no, i'm not that interesting <laughs> all right then uh, just 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 glad to be here glad for this opportunity awesome well thank you so much um thank and- you Congratulations on, on being one of the winners of Toro Fangata. Yeah, thank you. Thank you again. Our next winner was unfortunately not able to join us for an interview because they speak Spanish and I obviously don't. Um, but we were able to shoot the questions over to them and they gave us their response. So our next winner is referred to as Chaos Partis. Um, pardon me if I mess up that name. Um but we started off with the question, why do they love Final Space? They replied, I love Final Space because it's a series that I'm really engulfed with and it traps me with its unexpected turns. I haven't been excited about a series for years and I'm so grateful to have met this one. Our second question was then, why did you start doing art? When did you start doing art? Excuse me. And why? Um, they said that they started doing art in January of this year for just pure fun. Uh, they had no clue what they were doing, but it was just too much fun. Their first drawing was of avocado uh, in the their style, um, and they would say by drawing that that they met this incredible fandom and became a big, even bigger fan. Um, then we asked, "What is so special about doing art for Final Space? Um, besides that, it's fun. Uh, they can express themselves through this art. Um, the series uh, with its characters gives them so many ideas that function really well in their artwork." Then we asked, of course, who is their favorite character. They answered with Fox. Uh, he's a character that they're madly in love with, and they love his design. And um, they really would love Olin to allow him to shine a little more in the seasons to come. Um, and to wrap up, uh, they would just like to tell you that their Twitter and Instagram is at the hyphen Redmond, spelled R-E-D-M-U-N-D hyphen S-H-O-U. So you can follow them there. And that they simply admire Olin. Um, and they really hope that maybe one day their OC can make a uh, a mini cameo in the series like Josh's Mialapeno. So yep, that's chaos. And uh, congratulations and great job on your artwork. We really love to see it uh, in the Toro Fangata. All right. Uh, we're going to welcome our last guest to Into Final Space, chatting via Skype. Um, if you can go ahead and tell us uh, the name you go by and uh, a little bit about you. Hi. Um, I go by Ash Birch, and uh, I'm just a dorky little artist that tries to give the best to the fandoms that I'm in, and Final Space is definitely one of them. I uh, enjoy it quite a lot, so, yeah. Yeah, great. Um, my first question is that. Why do you love Final Space so much? Um, I really enjoy it for the characters, which are just beautiful, and their personalities are just amazing. The humor of the show is hilarious. I love it. And on top of that, the animation is crazy beautiful. I aspire to animate like that one day. Yeah, definitely. It's, uh, it's always a a great show to just turn on and look at. I mean, you just, even if you turn the volume off, it's always fun to just you know, watch Final Space. Yeah. Uh, um, so, yeah. Uh, when did you start art and uh, what kind of got you into that? Um, 
actually, I started getting into it after watching uh, Gravity Falls, which is an old show that uh, was really good and uh, had kind of had similar feel to Final Space, but a little younger rated, I guess. Yeah. Um, but started drawing characters from that, and uh, eventually more and more shows came out that I loved, and uh, I just wanted to keep contributing to those uh, communities, and here I am today with uh, lots of practice and uh, lots of time put into it, but I'm pretty proud of where I've gotten. Yeah, definitely. Gravity Falls, uh, I feel like, was a, a big spark for a lot of artists uh, of this this current group that really loves Final Space. Um, it's just... A similar type of you know feel to the artwork of something that you really want to watch. Yeah. So uh, so what's special about about doing fan art uh, for Final Space? That's you know kind of different from some of the the other groups that you're part of, some of the other fandoms that you're in. Um, I've just I found that the Final Space community is just so like accepting and supporting. It's amazing. Like everybody is just you put out 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 there and just like everyone just enjoys it, no matter if it's how little it is it could be just a little scribble and people just really get into it and it involves in the fandom and there's a lot of interaction which is nice and uh, getting feedback from the community is always wonderful yeah definitely everybody seems you know very supportive whether you're on instagram or you're posting stuff on twitter or you know especially within the the discord community um of everybody's just you know, we're really there for each other, you know, giving suggestions, nobody's coming for other people's art. It's always very supportive and uplifting whenever you post something. Yeah, definitely. So, of course, I have to ask, um, who's your favorite character and why? Well, if it isn't a little obvious because of uh, some of the stuff I draw, but my favorite character is definitely funny on the names, but Ash... She's just <laughs> definitely great. I love her. Uh, super powered, pink haired girl, just giving it her all, even though she's going through her little teenage issues. But she's uh, she's got a good heart, and I, I love that about her. And she's got such a quirky personality. So it's pretty great. Yeah, between teenage issues and family get, getting eaten by a snake, you know? Obviously, Sometimes, such <laughs> relatable content. <laughs> <laughs> uh, if I'm in final space, you know, just whenever your family gets eaten by a snake, you know, you can just really connect there. Of course. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, definitely. Um, and yeah, you you put out some some really beautiful art, and we were really really glad to receive that for Fangata. Um, is there anything else you want to? you know, kind of plug or promote any sort of socials that you want to put out there for people to go check out um, before we wrap up? Um, well, I mostly post on Instagram. It's probably the one I'm the most active on, but I'm also occasionally popping on, off of the Aminos and stuff like that. So, uh, yeah, just the the account that uh, you guys linked there, ashbirch762. That's uh, for my Instagram, and uh, I think it's the same for Amino as well. Yeah, awesome. Well, once again, congratulations. Uh, thank you so much for submitting, and uh, thank you for contributing to this awesome fandom. No problem. Thank you. And that's it for this week's special fan episode. Huge thanks to everyone who entered this art contest and to the Final Space Facts group for co-hosting it with me. Congratulations again to our winners for their incredible pieces. Our next episode brings you another exclusive Crew Tricks interview that I can't wait to share with you and you do not want to miss. Until next time, follow the show on Instagram and Twitter at Into Final Space, and you can follow me, the host of the show, on Instagram and Twitter at Gabriel W. Jones. Thanks for listening, and we'll see you next time on Into Final Space.